Saint-Germain starters. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Marquinhos plays with Sergio Ramos. Hey gamers, what's up? Welcome to Duff at 15. Your one-stop destination for all things gaming. I'm Vic. Today I will be showing you a fix for a problem which I faced with FIFA 2023. When I started the game, it was lagging and keeps on getting stuck every now and then. I tried resolving the issues by checking some online articles and find out that with so many players competing at any given time, it's quite possible that the servers might get overloaded. Now, this time, FIFA integrated the graphic settings inside the game only and uh, moving forward, I set my resolution to 1920 to 1080 and usually I keep my resolution to native one for my monitor. I highly recommend you to keep the same settings to your native screen. Apart from that, the display mode. Uh, keep this to full screen or windowed borderless unless you want to tab out a lot. For frame rate, I selected no limit on FPS. This is the best setting to use if you want to get decent frame rates with a good setup. Dynamic resolution scale. I turned it off. I tend to keep it off since I have optimized my settings for performance. Strand based hairs. I put it on auto. This option can be a bit demanding on your screen system, but you can keep it on for a better visual experience. A rendering quality. Uh, I selected again this on auto. This is the render quality of the image or graphics that will be produced in game. And the match is underway.